Judge Kavanaugh, it's my understanding that you have denied the allegations by Dr. Ford, Ms. Ramirez, and Ms. Swetnick. Is that correct? Yes. All three of these women have asked the FBI to investigate their claims. Um, I listened carefully to what you said. Your concern is evident and clear. And if you're very confident of your position and you appear to be, why aren't you also asking the FBI to investigate these claims? Senator, I'll do whatever the committee wants. I wanted a hearing the day after the allegation came up. I wanted to be here that day. Instead, 10 days passed where all this nonsense is coming out, you know, that I'm in gangs, I'm on boats in Rhode Island, I'm in Colorado, you know, I'm cited all over the place. And these things are printed and run breathlessly by cable news. You know, I wanted a hearing the next day. I, my family's been destroyed by this, Senator. Destroyed. And, I'm, and, I'm and, and whoever sorry. wants, you know, whatever the committee decides, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm all in question is, immediately. I'm all in immediately. You know, and the terrible and hard part of this is when we get an allegation, we're not in a position to prove it or disprove it. Therefore, we have to depend on some outside authority for it. And it, would, it just seemed to me then when these allegations came forward that you would want the FBI to investigate those claims and clear it up once and for all. Senator, uh, the committee investigates. It's not for me to, to say how to do it, but just so you know, the FBI doesn't reach a conclusion. They would give you a, a couple 302s that just tell you what we said. So I'm here. I wanted to be here. I wanted to be here the next day. It was an, it's an outrage that I was not allowed to come and immediately defend my name and say, I didn't do this and give you all this evidence. I'm not, even, I'm not even in D.C. on the weekends in the summer of 1982. I'm, this happened on a weekday? Well, is it, would, 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 I'm not at a Blair High School for a summer league game. I'm not at Tobin's house working out. I'm not at a movie with Suzanne. You know, I wanted to be here right away. That, well, the difficult thing is that it, the, these these hearings are set and um, set by the majority. Um, but I'm talking about getting the evidence and having the evidence looked at. And I don't understand, you know, we hear from the witnesses, um, but the FBI isn't interviewing them and isn't giving us any facts. So all we have. You're interviewing me. Say. You're interviewing me. You're you're doing it, Senator. I'm sorry to interrupt, but you're well, doing it. That's the the. There's no conclusions reached. And and what you're saying, if if I understand it, is that the allegations by Dr. Ford, Ms. Ramirez, and Ms. Fetnick, Swetnick, um, are are wrong. Yeah, that that is emphatically what I'm saying. Emphatically. The Swetnick thing is a joke. That is a farce. Would you like to say more about it? No. Okay. <laughs> That's it. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, Ms. Mitchell. 